for tuning in to Let's Talk About It Media 21. Please like, comment, and subscribe, and please turn on the notification bell. That way, every time I upload a video, you'll be the first one to see it. Let's get into it. What we're going to talk about, we talk about celebrity news, celebrity gossip, what's going on on IG and Google. Fair use. Copyright disclaimer under Section 107 of the Copyright Act of 1976, allowances made for fair use for purposes such as criticism, comma, comments, comma, news reporting, comma, teaching, comma, scholarships, and research. Fair use is use permitted by a copyright statute that might otherwise be infringing. All comments are alleged, in our opinion, and for entertainment purposes only. And don't forget, the Cash App is Let's Talk About It Media. And thank you for your love and support. So don't forget to like, to comment, and also subscribe, and also turn on the notification bell. That way, every time I upload a video, you'll see it. So let's get into what's been talked about. Kim, Kanye, Kim trying to do a post in regards to, oh, walking away from media. When we see it, then we'll believe it. We know the K's and the J's love media attention. They love drama. They love chaos. They love conflict. They love copying off people. All comments are alleged. But we see that there's a difference in regards to the K's and the J's family and other family members and fam famous people. Let's say it that way. So let's talk about what this is basically saying. Because I'm not going to read the whole article because it's clear there's certain entities that assist and help them in regards to posting stuff making comments about stuff. We feel, a lot of people feel that TMZ allege helps push a narrative for the K's and the J's. So a lot of times I read what the concept is saying about uh, TMZ, but then I, I take away and say, okay, well, did that really happen? Or is this what they're trying to tell us? You know what I'm saying? So this is basically saying things between Kanye and Kim are fine enough she does her best to maintain a good co-parenting relationship with him. Now, <laughs> did she see the trailer? <laughs> because wasn't she crying on an interview of how hard it is? Wasn't she trying to state when she sat down with her family at that table, him painting the narrative? <laughs> this is a distraction, y'all. This is a distraction because she's getting dragged for trying to utilize North to stay relevant and post different things on TikTok. Parents know. I said this three or four months ago. I had saw a video in regards to a grandmother saying that weirdos were saving pictures and videos of her granddaughter. I said that four or five months ago. People are trying to claim state of regards to that might be a reason why hers got banned. It might be a reason why her got banned because maybe many of the parents are saying, hey, enough is enough. Let's ban it for her to kind of slow it down because her 13, her 10, nine or 10 year old daughter should not be pretending like she is 23, 24. It's over actualizing, over actualizing, period. Then people are saying, Allegedly, then people are saying they're trying to groom the next generation too soon. Mind you, she started dating the Jackson boy. What? How old? 15, 16, 17. So if she's trying to push north already in regards to the industry, movies, TikToks, making videos, making content, she's doing the same thing she almost did to Courtney. Allegedly, Courtney got tired of it. I'm going to do what I want to do when I want to do it. Then you have her going to different events to get pictures taken. And then you have North saying, hey, stop with all the cameras. You're going to make a child go blind. 
You know what I'm saying? Why did she have sunglasses on her child? She loves the media attention. Many people feel like Kanye don't need to say nothing. He's not going to deal with the um, PR stunts. He's not going to deal with the gaslighting. He's too busy trying to rebuild his brand. Going through a divorce was hard for him. And the Pete situation didn't make it any better. So many guys are seek, seeing what Kanye went through. Many guys are seeing what Pete went through. We saw the gaslighting. Allowing your child to sit on Pete's lap. Allowing your child to hang out with Pete. Knowing that was going to bother Kanye. You know what I'm saying? So if she's having a hard time finding someone, we get it. Because many people now see what, what many people saw behind the scenes. Now everything that was really going on behind the scenes are coming full fruition. People are basically saying it's a end of an era. Many people felt, do y'all remember when she told her mom, we're not doing it your way anymore, we're doing it my way. Problem one, when Chloe said, Jordan Woods ruined my family. Problem two, we know Jordan didn't ruin your family. Tristan liked it to step out. He liked it to, he liked to be single. Okay? Then you have the Travis Barker situation. Problematic. The Lamar Odom situation. Problematic. I wish Scott would have stayed out of it. I wish he would just be focused on himself, be focused on Courtney. Because now do you know that they're bringing Courtney in the forefront in regards to media press and attention? Now, also, she's getting dragged because of the trailer in regards to Courtney feeling like Kim does things to the core and she only cares about brands and doing things that's going to promote her. Courtney's calling it. Courtney's now happy in a relationship and she's trying to tie her love story in with Courtney and Travis. What? Kanye's now happy in a relationship. She can't help herself but to tie her name to Kanye every month. And people allow it. People often post stuff regarding Kim and Kanye all the time. Let Kanye be at peace. When will she stop talking about Kanye? When will Chloe stop talking about Tristan? Old, boring storyline. So now they try and mix it up in regards to Kendall Bad Bunny. Is Bad Bunny still hanging out with his ex and having fun and all this other? We don't know. And then in regards to Kylie, is is that is Timothy claiming Kylie? Is he going to be a stepdad? Okay, well wishes. I see that this is being, she's being dragged and she don't, she don't really care. She doesn't care about the good press, bad press. She doesn't care as long as her name is trending. And that's the sad part. Most people care about their brands. Most people care about how they're viewed. But many people say that that's the concerning part because why is she protecting her daughter, mind, body, soul, and spirit? Why is she letting her daughter be talked about in the media? So Kanye may be, she may think that things are cool. She's the one that's putting the children in the media. You understand what I'm saying? It's not Kanye. If Kanye's hanging out with the kids, Kanye's hanging out with the kids. But in regards to the TikTok videos, they're very inappropriate. And many of us see it. And then she utilizes people who are trending. She utilizes things that are trending. I Spice trending. Uh, Don Lemon just got fired. She was in a picture with Don. T TMZ reported that. Oh, look at Kim talking to Don. Caption this. No. She likes to be around whoever's trending, whatever's trending. It's starting to seem weird. People are saying, is she okay? People are saying, is there a different traits of different things? I'll say it that way, but to be general. But well wishes to Kanye. As a dad, it has to be concerning. He has to be here, stay here to help raise these children. It is up to them how they're raised. It is up to them what's... What, in regards to what should be approved or not approved, I think the account should have both parents' approval. No, you can't upload it. No, you can't have my, you know, how do you deal with the, the school situation? There's other famous people there that are not filmed like that. You understand what I'm saying? But what was just, focus on healthy, safe relationships. Kanye, <laughs> he, he, he chose this as the woman to have children with. He, he's dated other women. 
but this is who he had chose to have children with. And their family loves media attention. They love to manipulate the media. Period. Remember how people are always saying how the mom, you know, does X, Y, and Z? It, that's not a good thing. Because think about the situationships that her daughters are in. Not in healthy relationships. Period. Chloe's the only, Courtney's the only one married and happy. And Travis loves her. Kim is single. Chloe's single. I really think Kylie's single. And, and, and Kendall may just be dating and having fun with Bad Bunny. But over the all, the mom is pressing her daughters to be in situationships. The mom can live her life where her mom is not, her mom's dating situation is not under a microscope. But well wishes. Mothers, teach your daughters different. Thanks for tuning in. Thanks for supporting the channel. Like, comment, and subscribe. Well wishes to Kanye. He's focusing on business deals. He's focused on different things. And I feel that they constantly like to talk about him, to bother him, get on his nerves. And it seems that he's extremely happy with Bianca because he's not posting anything. He's not doing any interviews. He's keeping to himself and he's minding his business. What will they try and trend for next week? What will they try and trend for the week after? You know what I'm saying? It's kind of sad. It's kind of sad. Every week they have to have meetings of what they're going to do and what they're going to trend for. Everyone, focus on healthy, safe relationships. Be around people that's strong in mind, body, soul, and spirit.